Hello everybody, Jen Matt here and now today is going to be special because now in this channel for the first time I will be playing a different game. Today I will be playing one of if not the best indie game in 2015 Undertale to celebrate its 7th anniversary. Now you might be wondering why would I play something that is old and not new? Well, now in this channel, I will be creating a new series where instead of playing new and recently released games, I will play old and classic games for the sake of nostalgia. I created this series purely just for fun and you know, I also want to experience playing the old games that I didn't play when I was a child and also preserve them for the newer generations to discover. Okay, so with all of the cringe intro aside, let's not waste our time and start our journey. Alright, so the instructions for this game are Z or enter to confirm, X or shift to cancel, C or control for the menu in game F4 for full screen it's already on full screen <laughs> hold escape to quit All right. when HP is 0 you lose so that is the instruction of this game I'm actually really excited to play this game alright so name the fallen human hmm I don't know what will I name oh I think I know Instead of naming our character Matt, which is the name I have been using in my Pokemon series, I will be using a completely different name from now on and it is going to be... Gian. Yes, Gian, you know, my channel name Gian Math um, in the Pokemon series. It is Matt and in this series I am going to use Gian and yeah I'm just going to choose this name because I actually don't know what name I will give to this fallen human or something but alright I'm we're just going to continue with this name alright is this name correct alright so here we go guys let's not waste our time and finally start our adventure here in Undertale. I'm so excited. Alright. So here we go. Oh <laughs> now we're here. Look at our character. It's she's so it's so cute. I don't even know what is um their gender like I, I don't know what gender this is. I'm just going to assume that this character is a girl. I mean look at the hair it's kind of long well it's short but well <laughs> I kinda look at this character as a girl alright so let's just move on right now okay so there's a character howdy I'm flowey flowey the flower hmm you're new to the uh, underground aren't ya golly you must be so confused someone ought to teach you how things work around here I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. Alright guys. See that heart? That is your soul. The very combination of your being. Oh, there's arrows. Oh, we can move with this. <laughs> Alright. Your soul starts off weak, but can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why? Love, of course. Oh, <laughs> love. Alright. So, you want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. <laughs> Alright, so... Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. What just happened? You idiot! In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Bro, this flower is evil. Die! Oh no, 
I can't escape. Oh, what just happened? Oh, what a terrible creature, torturing such a poor innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. Oh, okay. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you to the through the catacombs. This way. Alright guys, so finally we are going to start Bro, that flower It That stupid flower like terrifies me Alright, so what is this? The shadow of the ruins looms above Filling you with determination HP fully restored Alright guys, so the, fi the file is finally saved And alright, let's just continue all right. Welcome to your new home, innocent one Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The, ru the ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Okay. What is this sign? Only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, to make progress here, you will need to trigger several several switches. Do not worry. I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. All right. Press Z to read signs, bro. I just read the signs. Pressing Z. All right. Stay on the path. Okay. So let's just stay on the path, just like the sign says. Okay, let's just switch this. <laughs> That's already a labeled switch. Okay, splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let's move to the next room. All right. So, as a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Oh, okay. So, let's just talk to this dummy. I, I don't know how this game works. Right, you encounter the dummy. Um, dummy? Check. <laughs> Alright, dummy, attack, zero, defense, zero, a cotton heart, and a button eye. You are the apple of my... Bro, is that a, a joke or something? <laughs> it's a pickup line, I think, I don't know. Dummy looks like it's going to fall over. Hmm, let's talk. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won, you earned 0 XP and 0 go, okay. Ah, very good. You are very good. Alright, so let's just proceed. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Alright. So let's just follow this character. I mean, Toria, I don't know. Oh, frog. There's a monster or something. What should I do? Alright, so... Check. Frog it. Attack 4. Defense 5. Life is difficult for this enemy. <laughs> Toriel is mad at the frog it. Okay. So we won. Right. Oh, what is right? Sign. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Oh. Okay. So I think this is the solution for the puzzle or something like. Maybe here, here, here. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, that's what the sign says. So, yeah. All right. Oh, the spikes. Okay. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Oh, okay. Oh, that's kind of dangerous right there. Alright. <laughs> that's a lot of spikes. Bro, this. 
this place is really really secure like puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now right you have done e excellently thus far my child however I have a difficult request to ask of you I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself forgive me for this hey wait no don't leave me <laughs> all right so maybe we'll just walk through this hole or something I don't know okay so let's just walk bro she's just gone all right so let's just um go through the oh there's a hole oh okay <laughs> there there she is greetings my child do not worry i did not leave you i was merely behind this pillar the whole time thank you for trusting me however there was an important reason for this exercise to test your independence i must attend to some business and you must stay alone for a while please remain here it's dangerous to explore by yourself i have an idea i will give you a cell phone if you have a need for anything just call be good all right all right so we are just going to you know uh <laughs> proceed without her this time okay she's calling hello this is toriel you have not left the room have you um we just left the room <laughs> there are a few puzzles ahead that i have yet to explain it would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself be good all right right so let's just talk to this frog git right here ribbit ribbit excuse me human i have some advice for you about battling monsters if you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them they might not want to battle you anymore if a monster does not want to fight you please use some mercy human ribbit okay so i think that's the mechanics of this game playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination hp fully restored all right so let's just save our file right there all right guys so i actually um okay um what should we do um check wim zan attack Five defense zero. This monster is too sensitive to fight. I have no choice. Too sensitive. Oh. Um, Wimson's name is yellow, so maybe. Oh, we can spare. Right. Okay, so I actually forgot to tell you that. You know, um, actually, my. Pokemon Emerald series is kind of delayed because well actually I had problems with my you know my laptop that I use for you know recording the Pokemon Emerald series like yeah it was really really hard and yeah that laptop is kind of broken so yeah I I kind of need to delay that series for the moment and yeah i started to play this game right now so you know because it's almost the anniversary of this game i actually knew about this game i since i was you know uh, sixth grade or something seventh grade i forgot but actually i knew about this game and i actually to be honest guys i actually tried this game but i kind of forgot <laughs> like you know i kind of forgot everything on this game just like you know in pokemon emerald so yeah i kind of remember some of the things in this game but yeah I, I kind of forgot about it and now i'm back in this game so i'm really excited to you know play this game again i kind of miss this game or something <laughs> all right i don't okay there's another monster another whimson we can just spare the whimson we we don't have any gold or experience points you know right so right so what should we do no oh okay so we're safe <laughs> there's a hole what the heck all right so oh 
Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Um... Actually, I don't know which I prefer. Um... Right, so cinnamon or butterscotch? Um... Bro, I kinda don't know what to choose. Uh, okay. Cinnamon or butterscotch? No, I'm just gonna pick butterscotch. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh, another one. Hello? Sistoriel. Do you, you do not dislike cinnamon, don't do you? I know what your preference is, but... Would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. What was that? <laughs> Alright, so yeah, I'm really sorry for delaying the Pokemon series. Like, I actually want to continue it, but yeah, that that stupid laptop just broke. Like, it betrayed me. Okay, so three out of four Gray Rocks recommend you push them. And actually, guys, I am now in a new location, so maybe you're hearing, you might be hearing some background noises, but. Well, not really. <laughs> Alright. Why do I always encounter Whimsons? Like, what? Okay, so there's a, a lot of traps in here. I don't know. Ow! Bruh. Wait, what the heck? There's a path in here. Um, bro, there's nothing. Okay, so... Please don't step on the leaves. Don't step on the- What do you mean? Bro, I'm always- Bro, I'm, I'm always encountering Whimsons. Like, I'm not encountering any kind of monsters. Is there only Whimsons in here? I forgot. Alright, so... Oh, I get it. You should not step on the leaves. A pair of froggers hop towards you. Okay, so... Oh no. I actually don't know what to do. Okay. Okay. Check. Froggit, attack 4, defense 5. Life is difficult for this enemy. <laughs> hop, how... Oh! Ah! I'm actually kind of traumatized of what happened in... You know, a while ago. Like, there's a flower, like... Bro, that flower is scary. Okay, so um, we should compliment. Okay, Froggit didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply. Will be what? What? Alright. Ah! Alright. Froggit doesn't seem to know why it's here. Oh, Froggit A is ready. Alright. We should. That was kind of easy to dodge, you know. <laughs> like really easy. Also, I kind of played um, many bullet hell games when I was a kid. So, yeah, dodging bullets or something, projectiles is not really that new for me. All right. So we should solve the puzzle. Actually, we should not step on the leaves. Okay. Freak! <laughs> but I didn't know there's leaves in there. Okay, so let's just proceed again. Right. Another one. Oh, it's Froggit and Wimson this time. Froggit and Wimson drew near. We can already, like, spare Wimson. Right. Ow! Bro, what the stuff? <laughs> Compliment. Okay. Froggit in there. Yeah, okay, okay. Blush deeply, ribbit. Alright. Oh my! Bro, I, I almost got hit. Alright. Alright, so we should um, solve this one. Uh, didn't you read the sign downstairs? Yeah, I just read them. Um, I wonder where 
have to go. Ah, okay. So we solved the puzzle. That was great. Okay. This rocks up again. Wait, it's a new enemy. Mold small and mold small. <laughs> They're mold smalls. They're slimes. Oh, they can be spared already. We should just spare them. We should not waste our time. Alright. We should just push these rocks and... Wait. Wait, what? Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? This... This rock is talking. Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Actually, guys, I'm just going to voice act this character because... I heard that uh, they have different personalities, so... Yeah. <laughs> okay, just for you, pumpkin. Bro, that's not enough. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty. How's this? Um, bro, road direction. Hmm? That was the wrong direction? <laughs> okay, think I got it. Alright, finally. Hey! Bro, what the heck? Hmm? You want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Bro, your job is just to stay there, like... Alright, so... We should just proceed. Okay. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese. It fills you with determination. Alright. What is this hole? Wait. <laughs> this squeaking noise. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Alright guys, so... Ooh! Wait, who's this? It's a ghost. Is that a ghost? Zzz... is sleeping again. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force. Um, yes. Wait, what? Here comes Napster Blue. Okay. Um. Okay, so we just we should just check. Also, the music is different now. Napster Blue attack ten, defense ten. This monster doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, I'm real fun. Ah, oh, 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 bro. <laughs> Bro. Okay. The faint odor of ectoplasm permits per the the okay. I'm kinda confused. Okay. So what should I do then? Um, flirt? I just weigh you down. Really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. <laughs> Bro. What is that? The faint odor of Okay. Um we should threat? You give Napster Blue a cruel look. Go ahead, do it. What? Okay. Should just touch these tears. Bro, even the tears are bullets now. Napsa Blue is staring into the distance. Mm, maybe we should cheer? I don't know. You gave Napsa Blue a patient smile. <laughs> okay, what should I do? Ow! Bro, I don't know how to dodge that. Napsa Blue looks just a little bit better a little bit better okay so maybe that thing is working it should just chill you told Napster look a little joke <laughs> is this ghost some kind of depressor cheering seems to have improved Napster looks mood again alright so we should just cheer again Napster look wants to show you something let me try ooh I call it Dapper Blue. Do you like it? Oh, that fedora hat is so nice. Right, so. Blue eagerly awaits your response. Um, what should I do now? Cheer? Oh, G. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. That that boss fight is already over. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way I don't even know if that fight is a boss fight like that monster seems to be 
different from you know spider bake sale all proceeds to go to real spiders okay so leave seven in the web we only have six Maybe we should buy that later. Alright. Struggles? What is this? Did you miss it? Spider bed. Early now. Come eat spiders. Made by spiders for spiders of spiders. What? <laughs> Alright. Ribbit. Ribbit. <sighs> my friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they skip through my words by pressing X. Oh. That's right. Pressing X. Well, at least you listened to me. Actually, I didn't press X. Like, uh, I actually didn't skip the dialogue. Ribbit, ribbit. I heard using F4 can make you have a full scanner. They have a full skin. I actually knew about F4 when, you know, I just... I don't know. <laughs> but what does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I only have seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling to say the least, Ribbit. Oh yeah, there's oh, oh a new monster. We can just spare mold small. Right? Bean me is the best. <laughs> my my ghost is just oh, dancing or something. My ghost doesn't have a care in the world. Oh name is yellow so all right oh yeah we, we already have to go we, we should just buy a spider a spider bake sale or something I don't know spider bake sale yeah, I don't know. leave 7g in the web yes some spiders scroll down and give you a donut right, so we should just proceed oh. hello I just realized that it has been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Oh, okay. Some someday you might need um, you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Okay. Looks drew near. Looks. Alright. Check. Looks. Attack 6. Defense 6. Don't pick on him. Family name. I walk. Bro, this is a Star Wars reference. Looks. Looks. I, looks. I walker. Wait, what? <laughs> Please don't pick on me. Alright. Ow! Bro. Okay. Pick on? You rude little snipe. Okay, so I should not pick on Ah Bro <laughs> Okay, we did we that we did not get hit. Don't pick on. Finally someone gets it. Okay, we should just dodge this. I oh Okay. Oh It's already here <laughs> There is just one switch. Right. Bro, why would. <gasps> There's a switch in there! Bro, a, a literal carrot. Vegetoid. Vegetoid came out of the earth. What? Okay, so just check. Vegetoid, attack 6, defense 6, serving size 1 monster, not monitored by the U USDA. What? <laughs> Farm locally, very locally. Ah! Oh. Ah! Jeez! Dinner. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. I- Ow! Ow! Vegetoid's here. Oh. To just spare. <laughs> Bro, that bow was hard. Right, we should be careful. Oh, it's just small, small. It's just spare. Nothing like alone time. And <laughs> yeah, my ghost is just dancing. I don't care. Alright, so we should just. 
Bro, why did I go here? <gasps> what is this? You found a faded ribbon. A costume? I, I don't know. Right, we should just get to the switch. Right, we should just pull this switch. And there you go. We, we actually saw Nuts the Blue in there. Oh, there you are. I fell down a hole. Now I can't get up. Go on without me. Oh. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Bro. <laughs> ah, freaking vegetable. Right. We should not die. Get out of my face! Oh, what's this? The far door is not an exit, it simply marks a rotation in. Switch, press A. You know, uh, what? What should I do? In oh, it's already unlocked. Get out of my face. Swing your arms, baby. Yeah, yeah, you're. S is I wonder why my ghost want to be alone. Like, my ghost wants to be alone. Okay, what is this? If you can read this, press the blue switch. What? Blue switch? What the heck? Right. Ooh, 10 gold! Wait... Ouch! Oh... <laughs> oh, this is a flea... Did you just see that? <laughs> the soul having a leg... Wait, what? A blue switch? Where's the blue switch in here? You can read this place the blue switch. Maybe in the another in another room. I guess I don't know. So switch, press it. Nothing happened! What's the blue switch in here? There's there's no such thing as blue switch. Wait, what? Something in here. Just oh, press it. Yes. You hear a clicking sound. Okay. But I didn't know that one. Right. If you can read this, press the red switch. Red switch. Right. So I should just <laughs> get out. I don't have time for that. Press a switch. Press it. Uh, yes. Oh, okay. If you can read this, press the green switch. Ah! What's happened? Oh, okay. Bro, we're safe. Bro, I thought we came back. <laughs> Bro, I didn't know what happened in there. Right. We just... We should just... Get out! Press the switch. Press it. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we already solved it. Oh, wait, where to go? Maybe we should go here first. Oh, a frog. It. Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out here just a little while ago. Oh, okay. She was carrying some groceries. It didn't. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Ribbit. Intimidated. <gasps> There's a knife. You found the toy knife. Um, what should I do with the toy knife? And I, we actually found the faded ribbon too. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. Okay. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? This story. There, there. I will heal you. Okay. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to 
try to surprise you like this. Uh, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Okay. Oh, there's this one. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Alright, so... <laughs> Alright. We should enter the house. Do you smell that? Oh, <laughs> do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. Butter... Butterscotch cinnamon pie? She just combined the two choices we had earlier. I thought we might celebrate uh, your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Okay... This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Okay, so this is my room? Or something. Alright. Look at these cool toys! They don't interest you at all. <laughs> Look at... <laughs> An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. Okay. A box of kids shoes in a uh, disparity of sizes. A box of... Wait, what the heck? Okay. What's this? Oh! We just turned off the light and the music changed. We should just turn off the light. Wait, what? Okay. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Oh, okay. Right. Should just go in here. Right. Oh, there you are. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh. Did you want something? What is it? Um, when can I go home? What? This, this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this group book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. <laughs> All right. Here is an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails? Sometimes flip their digestive system as they mature. I didn't know that. Interest, interesting. Yeah. <laughs> well, bother me if you need anything else. Um. Okay. So we should just explore the home. I guess I don't know. Right. What is this? The stove top is very clean. Toriel must have used fire magic instead. Fire magic? The size of pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Yeah, that pie is too thick. Very thick. Right. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. Okay. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. For some reason, there is a brand name chocolate bar in the, in the fridge. Chocolate? Right. Should just ex more can we interact with this oh, okay not what is fire never mind <laughs> it's a history book here's a random page trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks we retreated far far into the earth we walk until we reach the cavern's end this was our new home which we, we named home what <laughs> As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. King. Oh. There's the ends of the tools have been filled down to make them safer. Okay. Okay, so 
what is this? Inside, inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 2001 X. Actually, guys, I am. It's really weird playing this game in 2022. Like the beginning, it, it is actually said 2001 X or something. I don't. 21 uh, 201 X. Like, bro. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Okay. Right. Should go downstairs? What is in here? Who? I think you should play upstairs instead. What? Okay. Right. So we should just continue. Where they explored our room? You have seen this type of plant before, but don't do not know its name. Right. What is this? Bro, we cannot interact with it. Right. Just a regular old bucket of snails. Oh, this is my tutorial's room or something. It's Toriel's diary. The, with the circled passage? Yes. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. That was funny. Or something. <laughs> I don't know. Funny, funny, I don't know. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. Okay. Right. What's this? Definitely bigger than a twin size bed. An encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open it to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, known more commonly as water sausages. Okay, water sausages. Is this, is this a cactus? Ah, the cactus. Truly the most tenderly <laughs> of plants. <laughs> Bruh. Cinderella of plants Yes, cactus is I mean, yeah, cactus is really harmful on the outside But in the inside, there's actually very uh, important thing in there Like, I heard it's water or something, I don't even know But anyway <laughs> Oh, it's a, it is a water sausage Okay Oh, it's a mirror It's you Okay <laughs> We should just. What should I do here? Alright, we should just exit the ruins. Maybe we should ask Toriel about that. What is it? How to exit the ruins? I have to do something. Stay here. What? Okay. Okay, so we should just go downstairs or something. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to live again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Okay, so we should just go upstairs, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Actually, I don't want to be aggressive. Like, I'm always respectful towards my mom All right so we should just sleep or something i don't know okay um what should i do now every human that falls down here meets the same fate i have seen it again and again they come they leave they die you naive child, if you try, if you leave the ruins, they, Asigore, will kill you. Asigore? I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Um. I, I don't really know what to do in here, guys. Like, I should just go to the room or something. I don't know. Just literally... 
literally nothing happened like what okay right do I know what to do do not try to stop me this is your final warning um, actually we should just proceed I guess, I don't know. You want to leave so badly? <laughs> you are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove, you prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh, oh we're going to fight Toriel! Toriel blocks the way. Um, check. Toriel attack. 80? Defense 8? Oh no. It's going to be hard. No one's best for you. It's just early. Oh! Ah! No! Toriel is acting aloof. Um. Talk? You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Oh, oh my! Ow! Ow! Okay. Toriel prefers a magical attack. Talk. You try to think of something to say again, but oh! Ah! Ouch! Jeez, bro, this is going to be really, really hard. Talk. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Oh! So just be careful, okay. Um, what should I do? Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the. Uh. 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 Whoa! <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. I should be. I should be. Wait, what? Ah! Oh. Ow! Bandage? Um, I don't want to fight her. Wait, what? You reapplied the bandage, you recovered 10 H. That was out. Uh, oh. What just happened? Um. Should I just spare? Okay, I survived that. Right, it's here. Bro, I don't know how to dodge that. Um, spare. Ah! Okay, we survived that. We just survived that. Okay, spare. Ah! Toriel looks through you. Spare again. What are you doing? Oh, it seems to be working. <gasps> Ooh, that was that is really the hardest attack. Attack or run away. Oh my god, it's low HP. What should I do? Um We should um, I don't know. Spare. What are you proving this way? Oh. Uh, 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 there you go. Oh. Ouch, bro. Why? Why? Fight me or leave. Ouch. Bro, that is really hard to the. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, okay. Stop looking at me that way. Come on. Ah. Okay. So I'll prepare some magical attack. Spare. Go away. Oh. Ouch. 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 Come on. Ooh. Right. I already know how to dash that. What? 
Toriel is acting ugly. I know you want to go home, but spare. But please go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but oh, we can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. Well, there's no turning back. Haha. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be ha unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh, <laughs> Toriel just hugged us. Goodbye, my child. Oh. No. <sighs> that was a sad moment, guys. But here we go. We are going to continue our adventure. Right, so... I wonder what lies ahead of us. Like, I don't even know what this... What is the world beyond this ruins or something. Don't even know. Right. The evil flower! Flowey. Was that Flowey? Oh, was that Flowey? Was Flowey his name? He's, uh, I don't know what gender this flower is too. Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's skill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the r life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you me meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die! Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much interesting. <laughs> Bro, the flower is messed up. Right. So we should just start this one. Undertale, <laughs> right? So the game has finally started by Toby Fox. All right, so we should just move on ahead. And this video is kind of long now, so maybe we're just going to stop the video if you know we we came across if we come across the yellow thing. Um, it's been smashed like it was nothing. Wait, what? Bro, the... Whoa! Oh, there's someone behind us. This... Oh no. Human, don't 
to know how to greet a new pal turn around and shake my hand okay <laughs> Bro, what was that? What the heck? <laughs> the old loopy cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Like, yeah, <laughs> but that joke is kind of old. I mean, prank, I don't know. Anyways, you're a human, right? Also, the maybe the voice of this character is kind of deep because of the sound effects or something that's hilarious I'm Sense, Sense the Skeleton I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now but you know I don't really care about capturing anybody now my brother Papyrus is a human hunting fanatic hey actually I think that's him over there I have an idea, an idea. go through this gate thingy yeah go right through my bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Wait, what the heck? The lamp is... It shapes like... Our character, wait, what? Sup, bro? You know what's up, bro? Um... This character <laughs> seems to be crazy or something. It's been 8 days and you still haven't... Recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you wanna look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great papyrus. <laughs> We'll get the all the things I utterly deserve. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in the in a shower of kisses every more shower of kisses? Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you're not helping, you lazy bones. <laughs> All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've got a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> Bro, that was a nice joke. Sans! Come on, you're smiling. <laughs> I am, and I hate it. <laughs> Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Well, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> Bro, he, he actually has four, fourth wall break. I mean, Sans can break the fourth wall. Wait, what? Ah, I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it now that's a nice joke <laughs> hey <laughs> okay okay you can come out now all right you ought to get going he might come back and if he does you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes yeah your jokes are hilarious just a conveniently shaped lamp. Lamp. Some sort of. It is some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. But there are bowls of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. What? Ketchup? Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but. Can you do me a favor? I was thinking. My brother's kinda been kind of down lately he's never seen a human before and seeing you might just make his day don't you worry it's not dangerous even if he tries to be thanks a million i'll be up ahead all right 
Oh, the music is nice. Oh, finally this uh, some kind of light. The convenience of that lamp still is you feel still fills you with determination. What the heck? There's a box in here. Alright, so maybe I should stop the video right now. This inventory. Um, what should I? Wait, there's a tough glove. What is that? Right. Maybe. I'm what the heck? The convenience of that lamp still still fills you with determination. All right, guys. So. I am going to stop the video right here now so I don't know what to you know what to do in this game actually in the next video we are just going to continue our adventure in this game and I am really excited of continuing this series like I, I really want to play some old games like this one I don't really know if Undertale is considered old considering it's just released on 2015 not not really that far but yeah this game is really great and i am looking forward to play this game like you know continue our journey in this game so yeah i am going to continue our journey on the next video and we are go going to continue our series so i'm going to stop the video if you like it hit the like button subscribe to my channel for more content like this and hit the notification bell icon to never miss an upload so thank you for watching stay tuned and see you on the next video as always guys stay determined have fun and goodbye to you all peace